You better take your hands off of me right now. Did somebody say that you could come into our house? You're obstructing right now. Do you no, understand No, you're that? obstructing. I'm not going to tell you again. No, I'm not going to tell you again. Get out of the car. I served you guys food. I sat out there and served you guys hot dogs. I wish you would just be nice to us. This Karen tried to bite police officers after they attempted to arrest her on domestic abuse charges against her ex-husband. This all occurred on June 9th, 2022 in Illinois, USA. This is probably the most stereotypical Karen that I've ever seen and her entitled reaction to being arrested is really interesting as well as hilarious. So let's take a look. Hey, step out of the car right now. Get out of the car. Ma'am, we'll talk about everything, but get out of the car. Yep. 20x per day, we're in the garage, she's closing. Ma'am, step out. Excuse me, excuse step out. me, no, excuse me. Step out. Get your hands off of me. Step out of the car right no. now. Excuse yes. No. Step out of the car. Get your hands off Get of me. Get out of the car. No. You're under arrest. No, I am not. Yes, you are. No, I am not. Yes, you are. Get your hands off. Open this off garage door. Excuse me. Let go. No, you get your hands off of me. No. Get out of the car now. No. I will tase you if you don't get out of the car. You better take your hands off of me right now. Get your hands Michael, off of me. Stop. I told you you're under arrest. Get out of the car. Why? Because you have a warrant and you're wanted no. for a domestic battery. Yes, you are. Excuse me. I just sent a message and I am... Excuse me. Excuse me. Get out of the car right now. No. I told you I can handle this peacefully, but you have to get out of the car. No, you would never yeah. said that. I sent you a message. My attorney... Affirmative. I won't cough on you, excuse me, did somebody say that you could come into our house? You don't stop tugging. I'm going to taste you if you don't get No. Yes. No. You're obstructing right now. Do you no, understand No, you're that? obstructing. I'm not going to tell you again. No, I'm not going to tell you again. Get out of the car right now. So the thing about Karens is that they are totally delusional due to a overwhelming feeling of entitlement and her body language shows this in a very real way. Normally when a person is encountered with a figure of authority, especially when that authority is a direct threat to them, you would expect to see their body language show signs of increased stress and the defense mechanism. This is the brain trying to prepare itself to encounter a threat and it makes us pacify, increases our breathing rate as well as makes us do distancing behaviors. She does none of that here, showing that her entitlement is so ingrained that even her subconscious doesn't feel at all threatened. This shows just how entitled she is. It's why she gives off the impression that she's an NPC. It's because she's not acting in a normal human way. I asked you all the car, I told you you're under arrest. Now you got a whole show for your neighbors here. You are a dick. Jennifer. My children don't have anybody at home right now. Zoom, You're going to put my kids alone in danger? I need to call my attorney. I'm not getting in that car until I call my attorney. That's I'm calling my... No, I'm calling my attorney. It's not going to happen. No, I'm calling my attorney. I'm going to tell you. Right fucking now. I know, no, no, I'm calling right my attorney. Right now you're under arrest. No, I'm calling my attorney. Sit in the car. My children are home alone. I'm giving you an order. Sit in the car. We will my get your father here. My children are home alone. My children are home okay. alone. We will and take care of your children. No, you're not taking care of shit. I'm going to get home. The way that you take care of somebody is throwing them down on the ground. Nobody you are your children on the ground. You are a shitty human being. That's messed up. You, you throw somebody down in front of their children? What the f is wrong Sit with down. you? Sit down! I told you to get you. Out. you! You piece of shit! You know what? You are the piece of dirt that I wouldn't piss on if you were on fire. I smell you an odor of alcohol on your breath. No, that's my piss. That's I, your piss? I'm pissing on you. Okay. Guess what? What? You're the worst part of the society. You think? I don't think so. Oh, no, I know it. I don't think so. I fucking know it. You are the worst. You take down a mother in front of her 
fucking children, but you are somehow I think he asked you pretty politely to get out. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. Were you there? It sounds like you were fleeing, right? Were you there? All right, we're good. Were you there? You saw my emergency lights before you even got in the, in the Were alley. you there? Like, were you bend there? Your, bend your legs. No, were you there? Bend your legs. Don't continue Were you there? Were you there? Were you there? Were you I saw there? what I saw when I walked in. Yeah. You're not getting out. She cooperated the uh, same bottle, same water bottle. Okay. Hey, I didn't tell you to get out of the car. Stop. Do you have your me. phone on you? Don't touch me. Do you have your phone on get you? Get your f***ing hands off me. Where's your phone? Do not. Where's your phone at? Get your. Or, uh, do not touch me. Okay. Did I ever say you. Terrell. Do. You fucker, do not touch me. Get his f***ing hands off me. You do get you your f***ing hands off me. Cool. Hey, if you keep resisting. Get your I'm going to charge you with that. If you, you know what? I'm going to charge you with putting your f***ing dirty ass hands on me. Stop moving. Let him take off your watch. F*** you. So she finally exhibits signs of the stress response, only when she sees that she's about to be dragged into a police car. She hyperventilates as well as murmurs unclear speech. The brain increases our breathing rate dramatically to fill our body with the oxygen it needs should it have to go into the defense mechanism. Adrenaline is released when the defense mechanism is triggered, which causes the muscles to tense up, which also makes her speech become difficult as the muscles around her voice box are more tense and restrictive. This is why we hear this weird changing pitch of her speech. And in typical Karen fashion, she chooses the fight response, even trying to bite the officer. There are three responses when presented with a threat, and that is fight, flight, and freeze, with freeze being the most common. She chooses to fight despite being dramatically outnumbered and in a disadvantaged position. This shows just how entitled this woman is. Her subconscious is so entitled that it deems the best way to survive an attack is to fight. And remember, the brain doesn't care about society, it takes any threat as a genuine threat to life. This shows how overconfident she is in her own ability. Shall I step out? Where's my watch? I have your watch. Oh, is it accounted for? What's up? I didn't get any paperwork accounting for it. We drove four blocks. He has custody of your watch in okay. the booking room. Hey, hey, guess what? Just so you know, with body guess, camera, your watch is right here, okay? Guess, guess, guess what? How about what's I don't take anything for granted. That's great. Can you hop out of the car now? I don't know. You want to drag me out like you, like you drug me in? Uh, no, I, I prefer you, not I, to. No, I know you enjoy that. That's your opinion. Can you no, get out no, now? No, no, no. It's what I experienced. Thank you. Are you going to willingly exit this car or no? I don't think I can because my feet are tied together and my hands. So I don't think okay, that I can I'll, I'll willingly. I'll help you out then. I'll help you out, Sean. Come on. Dick. Let's go. That guy. Hey, why, why are your hey, Put your feet back on the other side. No, no, no. no. Put your feet down. Put, put, put your feet. No, no, no. Put your no, feet no, down. No, no, no. It, it hurts too much. You, you could just, you could just take it off. Okay, no. We're not no, you're gonna kick it. No, what am I? I'm a fucking hundred pounds. You think I'm gonna take a two hundred pound dude? Sean, well, you've already kicked at us a lot of times. Sean, Why? You're not gonna win. Why? You're gonna hurt Sean, us. Why? Because that guy right there. The one you tried to bite. Okay, Sean, let's go. Why? Could you ask yourself a question? Sean, put your legs Why? down like this. Why? Because that guy beat me up and drug me out of my Sean, car in front just, of my hey, fucking kids. Hey, Sean. Okay. Is a dick. Let's go. That's why. We're going. You don't have you don't have any sort of consciousness or awareness as to hey, why. Stand up, Sean. I you can. No, I can't. You were standing outside of the car earlier, weren't you? No, how, can, up. how can I stand up? Then you need a security room, man. You're gonna be security room. You're gonna be security room. Well, you're not being nice to me since the You're not being nice to me. You never have. All right, then we're going to have to do you, do you know how many? Do you know how many f***ing times I've served you guys food? i sat out there and served you guys hot dogs. I wish you would just be nice to us. Instead of I wish you would be f***ing nice to me. Are you f***ing kidding me? You're making my wrists bleed? Well, it's following some blows, Sean. Yeah. 
Spoilers, this is so funny just to see this Karen being carried away as she calmly hurls abuse at the officers. After she has time to cool off, she is now showing no signs of stress whatsoever, only raising her voice to try and intimidate and appear dominant. This shows just how out of the loop she is, and doesn't see being carried into a station by numerous officers as anything to worry about, fully expecting that she's in the right and that her lawyer will get her out. Little does she realise the extent of the trouble that she's actually in. This Karen turned out to be 45 year old Sean Malarkey. After the events of this video, she was charged with a felony aggravated DUI, which carries a mandatory jail time, aggravated assault on an officer and resisting an officer and possessing alcohol whilst driving. A week after these charges were filed, she was then given more charges for endangering the health of her child, violation of bail and additional resisting charges. She was then taken to the DuPage County Jail. So thank you so much for watching this video guys, if you did enjoy it, please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more content and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.